Hey Alexa. Yes, Vi? I've been thinking, what do you think are the consequences of not having good communication? Interesting question, Vi. Well, you know that communication is a process of sharing and conveying messages, information, ideas, etc. from one person to another via different channels, right? Yes, and that communication can occur between two or more people. Very good. Now, the role of communication is very big and very important. So a slight miscommunication can cause a big misunderstanding, whether it's expressed verbally or not. Okay, how? Well, Vi, there are many barriers to communication, like one's emotions, strong emotions, psychological issues, noisy environment, syntactical noise, or simply referred to as mistakes in grammar that can make miscommunication happen. And while the results of miscommunication may be slight, there are some miscommunications that can lead to serious misunderstandings and can disrupt relationships, friendships, important business transactions, or can cause two or more parties believe that they are enemies, even though in reality, they may be not. So, now that I know what the consequences of miscommunication or bad communication are, I think I know the positive effects of good communication. Go on! Good and successful communication can transmit all kinds of messages successfully, and successfully transmitted messages can prevent or fix fights, problems, and misunderstandings. If people take time to communicate with each other properly and carefully, they'll be able to understand how the other person thinks. And even if they don't agree on everything or anything, they'll still be able to find steady ground with the help of good communication. Mm -hmm. So, if you have had a misunderstanding with someone because of something they might have said or sent, it's always a good idea to try clear it up with a good conversation. And barrier-free communication.